Jenny, hello. Great to see you over Zoom. You're out of the villa. You're back on homeland. How are you doing? Very well, thank you. Just uh, getting a bit of resting, you know. <laughs> and you're straight into quarantine, so you're going to have quite a bit of time on your hands. Are you going to be watching the show back? Nah. Nah, I'm not. I'm not. I, I'm not watching the show back now. I've um, if I do, it'd be in the distance. But right now, it, nah, it's a bit too, bit too raw at the moment. And you were so close to getting to the final. I mean, everybody I think thought that you, Jiberty, you and Liberty would make it to the final. Were you a bit gutted that you kind of almost got there, but not quite? Well, the thing is, obviously, it's an experience to get to the final, but at the end of the day you've got to kind of put where, where you're feeling first. And, and it, you, I don't think there should be a finishing line just to find when that's it. I think if what was right was right at the time, you know, so to, to get to the final wasn't even in my mind. It was just being with Liv at the end of the day. Like she, I was there from day one to, to the end. And then obviously we walked out together. Well, let's get into it with Liberty then. Right, big question first and foremost. Are you speaking? What What's the situation? Yeah, so we FaceTime yesterday for the first time. Um, oh, I only got her phone number a couple of days ago as well. So it's just, it's just weird. Like, it's just weird to talk to her. Like we were talking about being in the villa through our phones with each other yesterday. It just, it, I'm chatting to her like, like what? It just, it just was weird. But um, yeah, bless her. We spoke yesterday on the phone for about an hour and she's doing very well. So yeah, it's just, it's just nice. She's, she's smashing, you know? I know it must be weird. Like, you know, having spending like every moment together to know you're, you're apart. Is that tricky? It's not nice, to be honest with you. It's not nice to honestly being with someone for eight weeks, 24 hours a day, to literally nothing. It's like, huh? It's a bit bit, bit surreal, really. But like I said, it's, this, this is, we went into a bubble. We've come out of the bubble now, and now it's the real world. So it's, it's going to happen. A FaceTime for an hour. I mean, that sounds like it was a, a long chat where you was kind of trying to discuss maybe sorting things out or just kind of airing anything that wasn't aired. Yeah, I think we, it was a bit of everything, really. We were talking about stuff that was said from other islanders in there with each other and stuff she didn't know, stuff I didn't know, Aaron things. It was it was just all into one, really, and it was a case of, huh. it's just boom, 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 100 mile an hour, okay. like, straight away. And let's talk about these bracelets that you took in with you. <laughs> People were saying you took them, that you took them in as, like, a kind of game plan, but was that just something you thought, you know what, I'm going to pack them in the hopes that I will find someone that I can actually share it with? Yeah, I mean, it's, it's something nice. You know? I mean, it's a nice thing to do. I think it's a nice thing to do. So you've got something in there together. Like obviously, when you're in there, you've you've got nothing. You're literally, you've got the villa, you've got the people, you've got, you've got to kind of make do with what you've got. But I thought, bring someone from the outside in, if I find a special one, that's how I would give to. So I did, and then I got it back. So it was like, oh. <laughs> <laughs> and I feel like a lot of heat started on you around the time of Casa Amor. I'm not going to lie, Jake, I was a bit annoyed when you were bigging up the boys and saying, you know, go and do this, do bits. If you're single, do this and do that. Was that all just meant in fun? Was there any kind of malice behind that? Was there any game playing or was that just you being a lad? The girls in there knew from day one, I am a lad. I'm a jack of lads. I spent a lot of time with the boys. That's just me as a person. I just want to see them have fun because... When you're getting having conversations with people and they're saying they're not 100% into it, you're in there at that show to find someone for you. Yeah. So if you're not 100% into them, you need to find someone who you're 100% into to, you know, to, to progress the journey with. But yeah, yeah. I've, had, I've had a lot of stick from it, to be honest with you, um, <laughs> which I can understand. But like I said, you only see 40, 45 minutes of the show. Mm -hmm. You don't see the whole 24 hours. So when you put two and two together, I've, I've seen a few clips and been a bit like, mm. but like yeah. I say, it, it's shown now, and um, yeah, there, there's no, there, there definitely no game plan. I can say that for a fact. If I was to be playing a game, I wouldn't be walking out with Lid, would I? Yeah, totally. And let's talk about Millie because there's been a lot of rumours that you wanted to get to know her at some point. Is is there any truth in this, Jake? Tell yeah, me. so this blow, this uh, this is obviously blown up. I'm very quick. My first opinion on someone is very quick, and. With Lib, it was straight away, whereas with other girls, it wasn't. So it's like, why did I throw Lib away for, for, for something that's you got to work on when I was so happy with yeah. Lib? Do you see what I mean? Like, and it was plain sailing for you two. You were the only people that were an actual you know, couple for, for such a long time as well. And then do you think it was the movie night when things started to change? Oh, uh, I don't want to hear this movie night ever again, because I'll tell you what, I'm hearing it left, right and centre. And oh, <laughs> like, Jesus Christ, it, that, that was probably my worst 
day in the villa worst night day the next day it just oh, that was awful yeah it was a nice day and then it, it did seem obviously because we'd only seen an hour a night it did seem quite quick that it went from kind of that to then you know liberty wanting to kind of speak to you to, about ending things so was there chats in between that or did it did it kind of move quickly from then yeah there's obviously chats in between there's yeah. do you know what i mean like if, you, if you've got your girlfriend sat at one end of the garden all day and you're at the other end it's not that's not reality is it we spoke about it and we said yeah that moving like was the was the turning point really was the time and then obviously when Lib had that chat with you there was a lot of heat on you again because people were saying you, sh you should have fought for her more but did you maybe do that and we just didn't see it or do you feel like you, sh you could have maybe fought for her a bit more yeah so so when you're in when, so when you're in the villa like you say it's very intense you've got this person this person this person this person you've got all these opinions on your shoulders and you basically got to kind of either listen to them take it on board or go nah that's not right I'd say my own opinion. Yeah, we were, we were, um, we were talking about it and that, but like, so I feel like, yeah, now I've sat back and I've seen a few things and how the boy, like my boys from home have said about it. It's like, they understand where I'm coming from because they know me, but people that don't know me don't mm -hmm. understand. So yeah, as I sit back and look and go, Jesus, people who don't know me don't understand. And that's why everyone's got their, their, their back up. And yeah, I look back and yeah, I should have tried more. But that's not to say I wasn't trying in the villa, but you haven't seen it. Do you see what I mean? Yeah, I know. Absolutely. And now that you're out, you've got all this time. Are you going to fight for her now? Because you can turn it around still, Jake. Yeah, well, it's just trying to get a hold of her, honestly. Like, we're just so busy. Like I say, we're in contact. We FaceTime, so which is which is a good start, to honest with you. But, um, yeah, well, we'll have to wait and see, won't we?